do you know what's in your dog? It might look like a golden retriever on the outside, but maybe on the inside they're a little bit more Aussie Shepherd. It's an easier way to find out how pet owners find out what's under all that fur. MTN's Jill Valley goes on special assignment to find out what's something that's very important to know about your pup. At this Mission Valley Ranch, Border Collies rule. We've been breeding for uh, 30 some years and perfecting what we want in a dog. Joan and Lynn Mason sell their dogs to people around the country for search and rescue, agility competitions, working ranch dogs, or pets. But in this new world, it's not just about the dog. It's about their DNA. <laughs> this entire litter of Border Collies had their genetic tests that reveal, among other things, what they'll look like when they grow up, which is important to a potential buyer. We have one rough coated parent and one smooth coated. So the possibility is you can get both. So we DNA'd everybody. The females are all sorted out, so people have picked. You just put it between their cheek and you just turn. But potential buyers also ask that a pup's parents be genetically screened to either avoid or anticipate any genetic health issues in their puppies. The Masons are equipped for that because that information is valuable to them too. The DNA testing can help an owner feel assured that the animal that they're buying is healthy and it can give them information on whether or not the coat will stay curly or straight. But it also helps the Masons know which adult dogs they should breed together in order to ensure the health of their future litters. For example, Border Collies can develop a serious eye disorder. The Masons can breed a male and female with a safe genetic combination to prevent that time bomb in their puppies. Welcome to Embark. And that's one of the benefits of testing companies like Embark that's developed genetic testing kits revealing a dog's breed, ancestry, health, and even relatives. Embark touts a research-grade DNA genotyping platform that looks at more than 175 genetic health conditions and traits. It's important when you're not quite sure what kind of dog you have and you want them to live a long and healthy life. Embark veterinary geneticist, Dr. Aaron Chu. Dogs have been bred to be a certain way. When you think of a German Shepherd, you have a very clear understanding of how that dog's going to act and also what health issues that dog is predisposed to. Now, you lose that power with mixed breed dogs, right? Just because a dog looks like a dog breed mix doesn't mean it necessarily is. Doesn't mean you can make inferences about how the dog's life is going to be as far as, you know, like genetic risks. She calls it precision medicine into genomics, a science that's exciting to veterinarians like Trevor Ferguson at Missoula's Blue Mountain Veterinary Hospital. He's in the business of keeping animals healthy and DNA testing can help. Really is starting to intertwine with what we're doing here as far as diagnosing diseases and, and what the owner can do as far as collecting samples and understanding some of these diseases and, and maybe even being able to diagnose some of the diseases before they even are clinical. But where the science is exciting, the AKC Canine Health Foundation cautions it's just one piece of the puzzle. And I think that people are so excited about this and all of us in medicine and health and veterinary medicine are so excited about trying to get DNA to give us all of the answers for health testing and for disease that we forget that it is only one of the tools that's out there that should be used. And we've even heard horror stories of people actually euthanizing dogs over test results like that. The AKC Canine Health Foundation offers a lot of free online information to help dog owners understand what tests are appropriate for their dog breed that may not include DNA testing. It spent millions of dollars globally for research into canine health and it does urge pet owners to seek help and guidance when interpreting any genetic test results on their dog. As for the future, most agree. This is all just the beginning of a specific science that can give us the tools to help our dogs live longer, healthier lives. Just medication-wise, I think that the DNA aspect may be able to make new drugs available to us. You know, I think the sky's the limit on some of that stuff. In Missoula, Jill Valley, MTN News.
Interesting. Genetic testing is also used by property managers either by requiring DNA tests to confirm a dog's breed before renting an apartment. Plus, many do genetic testing on a dog waste to identify a dog and its owner when they don't pick up after their animal if they need to issue a fine. So be careful out there. It is time for a quick break.